Hello. Hi. Welcome. How's it going? How's it going? I ate too much dinner. <laughs> if I pass out midstream, that's why. All right. We're going to try and get camera to follow us again tonight. We're going to see if it freaks out again. <clears throat> Hello. Hi. Welcome. Good evening. Um, we are back playing. Where's, where's things? We're back playing uh, Control tonight. I forgot to hit start on the YouTube. That's fine. Nobody's watching there. Um, do, do, do. There we go. Yeah, no, there we go. What, just no music? Pretzel, you just gave up? I'm going to kill Pretzel and start it back up. <laughs> I have a feeling it needs to update. Do you need to check for an update? Apparently I'm just not allowed to have music. <laughs> just that one song, just this song over and over forever. Okay, hold on. What can we turn on? Polka? Oh, I'd be stupid not to. We're going to throw in some electro swing for the background music. You could always start the game. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm getting there. You had a zucchini for dinner? Just a, a whole zucchini? Did you do anything with it? You know, did you salt it? Did you, uh, you know, I mean, do anything with it? You cut it in slices and dipped it in ranch? All right. Yeah, all right. I suppose in that sense, I had some ranch for dinner. You basically had a salad. All right. You know what? Yeah, let's just get into it. Let's just fire up control. Oh, that's very loud. Why is that so loud? Switch that over there. And we have to get through all the splash screens. Oh, excuse me. Anyways, how are people doing tonight? Uh, Morris, Pokemon Freak, how y'all doing? Continue game. Look out for mods with unique names. Okay. Now, what the hell was I doing? Nope. Missions? M is for mission. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Uh... Hey, the training course. Am I allowed to go to the training course yet? Oh, oh resume. Dingo. Did a bunch of exercises today, so you're feeling good? That's awesome. I did some exercise. Okay, so... There's no fast way to get into there, which sucks. It's probably the NSC control room. It's the fastest way there. I think. Actually, could, could someone just tell me when I'm allowed <laughs> to go uh, into central maintenance? A lot's happened to Jessie in the first day of her new job. <laughs> new jobs. Uh, remember, she's moonlighting as the janitor. Okay, so I'm in here. Can I get out of here easily? No, I don't think I can. I think I do have to go to this one. Okay. 
now. I need to go this way. Nope. Oh, that way. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Right, that's punch, that's dodge. So... Oh! Huh. Didn't expect that. What are you gonna do? I'm up here, you jerks. So smart, cool, and handsome. And a terrible shot. Satisfying. Until somebody has guns. Once somebody has guns, this whole this whole thing is up. <laughs> Fuck that railing in particular, yeah. That was actually pretty satisfying. How do I change modes again? F, there we go. In case of explosions, look directly at the explosions. Yeah, I'm sure it's great for the encoder too. Yeah, so like, I wanna go into field training Why can't I go into field training? How do I grab again? Field training isn't into me. But why not? Oh, hold on. Fucking... <laughs> I have to remember, violence is usually the answer. Hi, Max. <laughs> Ooh, what we got? What we got? Nope. Why is that? Okay, great. <laughs> Thanks, game. Collectibles. I like to formally uh, file a formal complaint for you, the unauthorized use of my voice in a state of quality that I did not agree on. The fact that we are, uh, that they were planning to use the material from what I thought was a rehearsal was not communicated to me at all. Had it been, I would have uh, disallowed the use of those recordings. I want, to, I want use of the Ranger Field Training Course recorded messages to halt immediately. I will not stand for this humiliation among my peers. I will go to HR with this if necessary sign, Randall Pulaski. Randall Pulaski. I don't presume gamers don't look up and also assume gamers attack lily things. Amount of time. When you're ready to start, press the button. Is that all or I always did love obstacle courses. I don't. This is just proving my ineptitude. Uh developers assume we don't look up, but also assume we attack lily things. Well, the it hasn't been taught to me yet in this game to do that. So get ready, Ranger. Course starting in five. Four, three, two, one, go. E. 
25 seconds remaining. <laughs> But oh, fuck. Get up there. Fifteen seconds remaining. No. Five seconds remaining. Yeah. Did I do it? <laughs> Task failed successfully. <laughs> uh, all right. You know what? I'm taking it. That's that's a win in my book. Guessing this isn't usually part of the course. It's protecting itself. Okay. I forgot to reach back for my hat. Oh, you're right. Okay, so can I rip bits out of it? We're just gonna reach kind of right beside it. I'm talking about something. Use a shield. How do I shield? What's the button for shield? I missed it completely. Controls. Shield is Q. Oh. Does this drain? Okay. Oh, I can still dash with it too? Oh, but while I have it up, I don't regenerate energy. I see. Okay. Ah! Can you give me a second? Shield seems awfully permeable. It's more of a suggestion. Okay, so I can't shield and climb. Gotcha. All right, hot diggity. Ah, shit. Time to have a shield. Yeah, but I can't do anything when I'm... Can I... How do I... How do I drop shield? Oh, okay. Woo! Right, I'm still almost dead. Again, there's a dude. Oh, shit. There's also a dude right there. Uh, okay, he's... I vaporized him. Cool. All right. Where is he? Whee! How do I get up there? Hey, how do I get up there? Oh, 
Oh, the stairs. So yeah, when you have shield up, you can't, like, you shan't, you shan't, you shan't the shoot through cover. There might be an upgrade to allow me to, like, throw my shield. We'll find out. We'll go have a look. Containment procedure for the holiday memories tree. Okay. Item must be contained within a soundproof cell. Description or altered effect. A holiday memories brand white plastic tree with green plastic stand. The item repeats the words and phrases spoken within a range of blank feet, uh, always in a tone below something hurts. The verbal mimicry has profoundly distressing effects on the individual it is copying. Uh, the item was taken from the blank a Canadian research station established on Ross Island in Antarctica, uh, where it was used to celebrate the holiday season. In 1979, solar radiation damaged the radio, severing, or, yeah, severing the base's only means of communication with the outside world. After the frozen passages opened, a military expedition visited the base to re-establish contact. They found the base's occupants in various states of madness, rambling out voices in the tree. Military personnel discovered they also heard the tree speaking. After locking the item in a supply crate, they brought it back to the mainland, at which point the Bureau investigated or intervened. You always forgot about the shield. It doesn't seem like super useful. Uh, the safe. No unique procedures required. The object is a guardhouse brand home safe. Uh, weight measurements vary. When bound, the object allows uh, pair utilitarians to telekinetically gather items and debris from their surroundings. The object is currently bound by something. Uh, discovered in the basement of a home in somewhere Ohio, the object gained rapid interest in certain online forums dedicated to opening abandoned safes. After months of failure, the owner attempted to open it with explosives. The object survived with no physical damage. Bureau agents were dispatched, now confident of its paranormal nature. Uh, blood occasionally emerges from seam, uh, emerges from seam around object's door. Test confirmed the blood is not human. <laughs> X-rays taken of the object indicate that something is trapped inside, though the images are always blurred, which indicates the contents of the object are moving. All attempts to open the object have been unsuccessful. Okay, cool. We have a little safe pet. <laughs> Neat. We're not going to ask too many questions. You think you saw that pal the other day? <laughs> that was late. Okay. Okay, so we've done the power. Black rock is nothing for us right now. We can't do anything useful there. Oh yeah, free health, I'll take that. Shit, shit. Hey man, explosives are awesome. Unless you miss. Is that just a cardboard box? It is. Whoop. Damn. Oh god, you all have shields. Okay. Okay, this is this situation has escalated. Like mightily. Oh shit! <laughs> Explosives are not good when they're beside you. Uh Man, I'm just racking up clips today, huh? I still have... Oops. Okay, I've still got it. It's fine. Another tombstone for the pile. It's true. Uh, okay, now we can go do whatever the hell it is we need to do here. Abilities. So, shield, shield strength. One release, shield propels debris. Ah, there we go. That's that's what I was talking about. So you can shield and then cannon it at people. That does seem useful. Um, punch more good. Yeah, 
You know what? I'm going to invest a little bit in shield. There we go. Now I can I can utilize shield. Let's try that. All right. Yeah, okay. So, so that does that much damage. Yeah, okay. I probably shouldn't be denting this, right? Uh, where was I going? Oh, I was going to use the teleporter. <laughs> right, the Got a little sidetrack there. So we need to go to where? Where do we need to go? Uh, research sector. Okay, where's that? Elevator, right? I have to take the elevator. Where the hell is the elevator? The elevator... Is this way? Yep. On the sign, clearly marked elevator. Perfect. It's not like there's anything incredibly dangerous inside. So the paranormal power plant loves getting smacked around. You don't know what it's into. Where the fuck is the elevator? Oh wait, no, this isn't the elevator I want, is it? No, this isn't the one I want. That was an other different elevator. I want this elevator. You know, the one labeled elevator, not ventilation. Obviously. Wait, this just goes to coolant pumps. That's not what I want either. I need to go to the other, more different elevator. Okay. Hold on. Back to... Mail room? No. Back to central. There's an elevator near here. That I know for sure. Yeah, like that one directly in front of me. All right. Time for actual content. <laughs> okay, hello. Hmm. Well, that doesn't look right. Damn it. Collectibles. Multimedia. Research sector. Teach me. Welcome to the research sector <clears throat> of the Federal Bureau of Control. I'm Dr. Casper Darling, head of research. Somebody thought this video would make for great internal communications. <coughs> I'm looking at you, Mr. Tomasi. So, this is where the magic happens. Anyway, <laughs> I've been here for 24 years now. 24 years. I've always been here. Years, Interesting. Made astonishing discoveries. Authored studies of grave importance. And in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep pushing the known laws and borders of reality and to make the Bureau proud. So, welcome. Assuming you have the necessary clearance and, and do follow the safety protocols. Read the manual. Otherwise, bad things will happen. I just say, I love him. Everything about him, I love. The way they have designed him, the way he talks, just everything about him, I adore it.
Ritual Division. All right. So I was just wondering about the plants and research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? I mean, the janitor does have a nice voice and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe you could just switch it up a bit. I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. Where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted and people like them a bit too much if you ask me. Are we being invaded by house plants? Worth looking into. Dr. Lewis. <laughs> I don't know if I want to be him or with him. Uh, neither. I think I would enjoy playing board games with the man. Uh, synchronicity and the Unseen Connection. So, synchronicity, synchronicity is a phenomenon long recognized by the wise, but only recently given a name by science. It's how we rationalize events connected by no identifiable causality, yet clearly conjoined in a purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? White hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away. The world is filled, uh, or the world is unified, not filled, different, different word completely, in ways we do not yet understand. And sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen chords and wonder at the result. Uh, sexy, sexy board games? Yeah, like um, Twister and Strip Poker. Uh, the visionary Carl Jung uh, laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably reproduce blankety blank 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 behavior by the close of by the close of nineteen fifty-nine. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. History may not remember our names, but God himself will. <laughs> That's how you want to be remembered. History will forget me, but deities will fear me. Also, I saw you pop up there, you know? Uh, heck, totally lost track of time. Uh, went way better than the first time. I'm barely in pain. Oh, that's awesome. You're sure we'll get it worse, but like, you're already doing better than you were. Oh, hey, guys. Yeah, I see ya. Oh, fuck. I'm just gonna switch. Whee! I know I can't. Oh, shit. That's new. Gotcha. <laughs> Can't dodge everything, you jerk. Don't. Stop it. Stop it. It'd be cool if I could dodge anything myself. Who's shooting me? Oh, hi, man. Can we be cool for a minute? No, no. Next. Oh, there you are. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't know how to grab your missiles yet. There we go. I didn't learn that parlor trick. Here, the music's still going. Oh god, chat stuck due to scroll. <sighs> You're, uh, I know from last time that day two was the worst. Yeah. Oh, oh, he, hey, thanks, man. Thanks. Gave me, gave away your position, idiot. Snipers. All right. Fine. I'll make my way to you. That's why you have the scope. I understand now.
All right. Yeah. Okay, so these, like, chest high things are literally just stop me being able to do what I want to do here. No! Oh, God. Yes, yeah, so you guys got the Borderlands 2 throwing ability, huh? One HP in a dream, baby. Woo. Ah, <laughs> I think I did pretty well there for getting shot up a lot really early on. <laughs> Not enough. <laughs> Do I have to re-get the collectible? That's what I want to know. I don't think so. No. All right. Oh, we can John Woo the, the buildings. Or the trees. Oh my god, I can't hit shit. Oh, did I put him down? Oh no, you, you, you get back up. Okay. No, no, we're not doing that. Here come the pretzels. Whoa, what? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Down he goes. Okay. I, th I thought about that guy. I was like, did I kill him or not? I don't know. But he was just kind of just chilling out. <laughs> Sorry, where are you? Oh, there you are. There we go. Jesus Christ. These guys also get the one HP in a dream. I'm not doing quite enough damage to them. Even when I headshot them, they, they get to stand with like one extra health. Kind of rude, being honest. There. Right. Oh, oh, there's a named guy. Probably what killed me last time. You're in this. Woo! There we go. Just keep hucking things until the problem is solved. Blip. Cool band name.
Okay, so where do I want to actually go here? Find Marshall in parapsychology. Parakinesiology. Ritual division was up there. Parakinesiology is right there. Which looks to be on the other side of that. Okay, well. I'm going to get attacked again. This area is way too big to not get jumped again. Okay, utilization of paranatural elements thresholds. Thresholds have always been uh, sources of great inspiration and great challenge. When a new threshold manifests in the oldest house by something, we never know uh, what new discoveries it will provide the Bureau. But we must always seize these opportunities. This report will examine the process of distinguishing recent threshold effects based on the utilitarian possibilities. The quarry brought black rock, one of our most invaluable discoveries, but if the mold has any scientific value, it has been difficult to find uh, due to the lengths we must go in fighting back this particularly prolific plant. Just had to do the alliteration. Uh, these are very distinct cases and worth comparing as their study offers vastly different dangers and rewards. Ah! Mold! That's a lot of fucking mold. Alright, we're probably not going in there right now. I think I might be able to dodge my way in there, but I don't think I could get out. For who among us has touched the foundations of this world and deemed them solid? Here's the washrooms. Ooh, big washrooms. Moving up in the world. One day I'm going to find something important in the bathroom. I'm going to be so glad I did this. Resale value plummeted. It's true. The lack of remediation is just atrocious. Oh, hold on. Aha! That makes it all worth it. Worth? Worth it. Hi, Carla. Does it strike you as odd that Darling insists on having us appear in those bizarre videos of his? I mean, we just stand there. He doesn't even let us have lines or anything. Don't get wrong, beats a day at the lab. Plus, it's always great to work with you. Oh, yeah, I finished the comparative analysis of the two Blackrock samples he sent. The prism, or whatever you called it, uh, I filed them in the usual place under C for Carla. Uh, handy mnemonic advice, all right? <laughs> oh, Jesus, Hubert. Anyways, let me know if there's anything you want to discuss about the data. I'll gladly explain. Maybe we could chat about it over some drinks or dinner even. Can't remember the last time I had a good steak. Maybe we could go together after work sometime. Oh, Hubert. Oh, buddy. Ah, oh, jeez. Alright, cool. Cool. Good radio. It might not be playing anything because I have the whole... Don't get copyright strikes on my videos. Uh, turned on. Eh, what's, where am I? Where am I? Hello? One day I'm going to open the, one of these and bad things are going to come out. 
It hasn't happened yet, but I'm being set up for it. I know it. Oh, is this the other side of the mold pile? Kind of looks like it. Okay. Ooh, it's in room number one. Okay. Oh, I guess that's the mold sound, right? Is there anything else to do here? Did that. Did all the... Yeah, that leads down. So those both lead to the same... Or lead to the same direction. Ooh. How do I get you? Can I... Okay. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, so that leads over there. Can you use the button? Can't use the button. But this mold also doesn't seem to be hurting me? I thought it would. Oh. It's not spooky at all. Hmm. How do I get you? Oh, hello. Let's not. Hello? Oh, hello. Hmm. Ooh. Wait, who? Oh. Where'd you come from? This is... Oh, for fuck. God damn it. Yeah, I'm going to die here because uh, uh, those guys just spawned out of nowhere. I don't know why they just suddenly showed up. But I was not in a great spot there. <laughs> I should have just dashed out of it, honestly. I let myself get pinned down by the explosive guys when I could have just run away. Oh no, do I have to do that whole thing again? Guess we'll find out. Oh, it's a shelter over here. I just completely ignored. Oops. Service hatch. Interesting. A possible AWB in which an unnamed individual experienced tra uh, transcorporate. Oh my god. Transcorporeality via phone line. Uh, event is notably similar to A to B blank in which blankety blank blank. Event is believed to have been caused by something, and as a result, the following measures have been taken to prevent it. Okay. Fuck me. Well, now I'm just... Ugh. What the fuck, man? Oh, dang. Oh, that's open now. Why is that open now? Okay, whatever. I'm going downstairs. 
I don't know why that door is open. I'm glad it's open. Ooh. Got bond vibes to it. Ding 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 Sorry, man, can't listen to you. I wish I could listen to you and keep doing stuff, but... Yeah, I'm not doing that. Oh, look, there's the lyrics. Auditor experience, Poets of the Fall, My Dark Disquiet. Answer the questions within two minutes of listening. Does the sun elicit any particular memories? If so, elaborate. Did you at any point feel strong emotion? If so, what emotion? Did a clear image of a weapon appear in your mind during the song? If so, please elaborate. Provide a detailed description of your current surroundings as you see them. Have you ever heard the murmur of voices when no one is present? If so, what do they say and do you hear them now? Which of these choose from one of the following pairs? Uh, one or two, A or B, day or night, apple orange, burn out or fade away. Okay. Holy fuck, you just get fucking bombarded by that song, huh? Hold on, wait. Aw. Man. Okay. So she killed the mobs, the door cleared, as though you uh, shot the blocks. Oh. Were there blocks that I could have shot? Still don't know how to get you. I guess I'll eventually learn how to fly or some shit. But as of right now, nothing doing. Was the fall equals old gods of Asgard equals the band Remedy loves to use uh, for their stuff. Uh, but um, their music will cost copyright strikes. Oh, bummer. Okay, do I want to go upstairs? I know parapsychology opened up, but like, there's also up. Oh. I did it to my fucking self. Okay, what the f What? <laughs> Old Gods of Asgard are an in-universe for Control and Alan Wake. Yeah, well, I mean, it makes sense. They're of the same universe. Okay. What the fuck, man? I just... I just... I got exploded. Oh, fuck you guys. Sideways. Really? Oh, you're still up. Fuck. Fuck. Off. Where's the other one? Nope. 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 None of that. Okay. Can I go upstairs now? I check that one. Yeah, check that one. Yeah, that... Poof. That was a thing, huh? Went from zero to exploded in record time. Uh, Darling's office. That seems like something I should poke around in. Dimensional research. Oh. Alternative perspective of objects of power and their astral connections. Dr. Darling is insistent that certain objects of power share a direct connection with this, the 
board, I guess, an entity or group of entities that we have little information on or little that I'm allowed to access. In his written reports, he states that there is a uh, clear link between these objects of power, the uh, board, the astral plane, and the oldest house itself. His work supposes these links are innate, uh, a fact ingrained into the very something uh, of objects such as the hotline or the service weapon. But what if these particular objects were never linked uh, to the uh, board, but had that connection forced upon them? Isn't it strange that no other object's power requires such direct contact with the board? Isn't it strange that using the service weapon or the hotline will result in grievous harm or even death if the user is not the director or at least worthy of the role? Why do we assume the involvement by the board is a natural fact and not something more, I don't know, sinister? Yeah, I'll get to your video in a second. Examine if paranatural uh, topics the astral plane and object of power. The Bureau has spent years studying why objects of power transport users into the astral plane when touched. My predecessor, Dr. Ash, theorized that a potential receptacle determined by a uh, Jungian or Jungian archetype, uh, archetypes and the collective subconscious would be inhabited by paranatural energies when the AW occurred in its vicinity, creating an altered item. Over time, a link was created by the something in the astral plane to that item, making it an object of power. So, Many additional theories have been raised since Dr. Ash's time. Objects of power were placed on Earth as tests by some astral entity. Our dimension was once part of the astral plane, and the objects were left behind as its borders receded. The astral plane was an early threshold into the oldest house, but the connection was severed, and now the two were linked solely through objects of power. I will attempt to disprove some of these in order to thin the herd. Okay. I suspect my colleague, Dr. Harrington, has already contacted you asking for an increase in her department's budget. I'm not surprised. Parapsychology has always been the squeaky wheel. All fuss, but no results. Parakinesiology has always been the stronger department. More breakthroughs, more tangible data, more usable research. I'm sure a man of your esteem can plainly see which department is more deserving of the budget increase. Just think what those additional resources could do for an already formidable research team. Anyways, I know you're a fan of single malt, so I left a bottle of well-aged brown on your desk. You're as an admiration, Abraham Lewis. Despite what you may have heard, HRAs are not monitoring devices. They're not tracking your movements. Utilization of paranormal elements resonance. Resonance. It's there, but we can't see it. It vibrates around us, through us, from us. But what if the vibration is conscious? What could a force like that do? Someone opened a door to a something I've called something else. The something emits a force that is far beyond the forces we previously dealt with. It's shown me so much that I have to wonder. Is resonance the key element in all altered phenomenon? AWEs, altered items, objects of power. Do these share a common something uh, that we've yet to discover? We can harmonize control points. What else could the correct frequency allow us to achieve? What if resonance has been the answer this whole time? Listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. <laughs> we do that regardless whether or not you're wearing an HRA. He's looking a little worse for wear, huh? Multimedia, can I just watch this in in glorious HD? Yeah, here we go. I've been fielding questions recently regarding HRAs. He's not looking so great. Do you always need to wear them? And what's the deal with the Hedron Resonance anyway? <laughs> Jesus. I... Fuck. Despite what you may have heard... <laughs> He's got a cut on his hand now? That's such a fun little detail. We're not tracking your movements. We're listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. We do that regardless whether or not you're wearing an HRA. Think of them as uh, 
as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the like he's got a little cut right there on his hand. Is, um, classified. One day that classified, not water, might pour in and you'll be glad you got a, got an HRA keeping you afloat. And if you don't have an HRA, don't worry. It'll be uh, quick and painless. <laughs> kidding. I'm kidding. We're making more. Oof. Boy, that's an energy. <laughs> right, so where do I need to go here? I guess I... Should I go into... Should I go into here? Dimensional research? Can I even? heard about this in what way oh hold on well I'm here now I live here That's weird. Is the rule of three still applying? I guess I'm not supposed to be here yet. I'm not ready for here yet. Thank you, Max. I kind of got that vibe because that just seems to loop. So obviously I need something else for that. But thank you for confirming my suspicions. <sighs> that dude in a wheel... These guys are in hover chairs. That's neat. Hmm. 
Where's the other one? Hmm. Where are you? Oh, down there. Oh my god. Why am I fighting a busted Charles Xavier? There we go. Oh, no, of course there's more. Oh my god. Can't hit my goddamn targets. <sighs> there he is. If you could not, sir. Sir? <sighs> I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I'm getting kind of tired by the enemy spawn rate when I'm just trying to walk around an area. It is irritating that I'm not allowed to clear and explore. Okay, the sniper. Uh, Bureau snipers specialize in eliminating threats from a distance using the telltale searchlights affixed to their rifles to search for targets. Uh, his snipers are no less lethal. Their corruption has not changed their tactics. They clearly prefer to maintain a good distance from their target, waiting in elevated positions for a clear shot. Care should be taken in open spaces. Check from balconies. I should note that the rifles are equipped with a bayonet for close quarters combat, and the his snipers are well aware of how to use it. Cute. Is that it? Oh, another one red. No, that was it. All right. <sighs> yeah, okay. She's in trouble. I need to reach her. Which way am I going? I can't see. Can I have a flashlight? Is that asking too much? Well, I guess we're going this way. Hello? There we go. Ugh. Oh, that's not explosive. Oh, hey, guys. Oh shit. Ah, that's not good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Exploding things are awesome. Oh, 
Okay, 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 okay. Ooh! God damn it! No, no, sir. No, no, thank you. Oh, that was very close. All right, we cool. God, this game makes me tense. <laughs> Mostly on account of I'm not very good at the combat. <laughs> Here we go. Hello. Uh, transcript of the call to California State Emergency Services. Uh, 911 was your emergency. Hello? Hello? I'm here. Can you hear me? I can hear you, ma'am. Where are you? I'm, um, inside the wires. I'm lost. Ma'am, have you been drinking tonight? I feel like I'm stretching through a wire, the wire towards you. Don't hang up. I might go if you hang up. Go where, ma'am? Go. Gone. Away. Okay. Can you describe your surroundings? Unknown noise. Ma'am? Hello, ma'am? Oh. Oh, hello. Huh. That doesn't seem great. That... What is that? Crash test dummy. Okay. Oh, another one. You guys just hanging out in there, huh? Alright. Oh, hold on. I can actually explore upstairs. Didn't even bother to look. What else we got? Empty room. Cleaned room. Some more crash test dummies. All right. Ugh. Okay. Next. I'm just going to crack open the video so I can watch it properly. The astral plane. Similar to an iceberg, what you see is not what you always get. Regardless, this place is vitally important to the Bureau. Most information on the astral plane is, is classified, but we can talk in broad strokes, keeping in mind that these are staggeringly complex systems, and simplification does them no justice. <clears throat> now, the white <coughs> non-space, the Cute. ever-present inverted black pyramid, the board, all linked, intrinsically tied to the oldest house, tied to the director, the process of choosing a director, tied to all objects of power in terms of who controls them. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. The astral plane. Oh, control point. Hell yeah. on the astral plane is, is classified, but we can talk in broad strokes, keeping in mind that these are staggeringly complex systems, and simplification does them. Right. What do we got here? Uh, the astral plane exhibition. The astral ex exhibition was originally built for the uh, astronauts to use as a, a training location. A place to grow accustomed to the sights and sounds of the astral plane before diving into the real thing. We could have done a better job with it, but Blank was being stingy with the budget. However, once we discovered the Blank, we decided to repurpose the space. Similar to how zoos hope familiar surroundings will affect the well-being of their animals, we hope to observe the Blank's behavior in an environment similar to its home dimension. So far, it just breaks everything we put there in it, but uh, Rome wasn't built in a day. Addendum. New naming conventions have been established for the astral engine known as uh, Astral Spike. Outdated terms in this report have been redacted. Okay. Hmm. 
What the fuck? Let me see. I'm not allowed to get climb up there. Rude? Eh. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. An early hypothesis was that the mindscape of the astral plane is subjective. But that was fast proven wrong. It's an actual place. Not, not a construct of the mind, even though it is with our minds that we enter and experience it. But then one could argue that that's the case with all reality. We've been able to record footage of the astral plane by monitoring the brain activity of those experiencing it. That is the only concrete material that has come out of the astral plane expeditions. A apart from one shocking exception. Which is the astral spike. The astral plane footage were always in the vicinity of the pyramid. We've concluded that this, not the entire plane, is what the board controls. We have glimpsed movement native species always in the distance and yet contact was made we don't have footage of this a technical malfunction but when one of our astral knots returned a brain cloud an astral fume had hitchhiked a ride in his head hmm. it ruptured out killing the subject in question it's a relentless predator pursuing thoughts minds lethal to those the entity feeds on oh boy containment protocols are to be observed when dealing with it i can't wait <laughs> I'm certain we're not going to have to interact with that. And by interact, I mean murder. I can't believe they keep that thing here. Oh, it's that thing. Oh, he's just fucking it all up. Yeah. Yeah, I remember this guy. Trash in the place, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna have to fight that fucking thing. I'm not looking forward to that. I'm gonna have to fight that thing right now, aren't I? Yup! Nope. Okay. Well, that's not what I shouldn't have done. You know what this button does. Yeah, it's a, okay. That's just what I expected it to. Do. That's fine. Okay, I understand. I understand the task. Yep. Come on, champ. Come on. Damn it. How do I get you in there and get you to stay in there? I don't know how to get it to stay in here. Hey, buddy. Nope, that's not what I have to do. What does this do? 
That locks that. Keeps that open. Okay. I can understand the task. I just don't know how to make it stay. No, oh, all right. Because, like... Comes in here. But the second I go down this hallway, he runs away. Oh, did I do it? I just had to go faster? Oh, okay. What was the Bureau doing with that thing? All right. <laughs> Marshall, are you still there? Shit. We're so close. We need to hurry. What the fuck is that? Ugh. Okay. Do, 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 do. you fucking oh, okay yeah well that would do it okay so that thing heals okay i kind of i had i had that vibe oh now i gotta walk all the way there Kill those immediately? Yeah. Where is he? Okay, there we go. That guy right there is the one who fucking blew me up. Last time. Okay. Damn, guys can thread that needle with an explosive. Where is he? You got aim like me. That guy over there. Nope, there's still a guy. Oh, oh, he's sneaking up behind me. Sneaky. Thank you. All right, we're not done. Still more. Where is he? 
probably up there. There he is. There he is. It's gonna be annoying. Come on. Okay. So now it's just me and that dude. And that dude behind him. And that dude behind him. Oh, I guess the shield back? Ugh. Man, I really should have invested in the grabbing explosives out of midair thing. Please don't misgender the horrible monsters. What did I say? I'm sorry. I should I shouldn't be misgendering the horrible monsters. You're right. Okay. So now we've ungoofed that. luck okay all right but first i have to go back and find everything that i walked past okay this report serves as an introductory guide to the astronaut program including candidate requirements training practices and astral research procedures astronauts are chosen individuals who explore and document the astral plane by making physical contact with the x-ray light box okay in the hi hypnosis lab a section of the parapsychology division. Uh, physical and psychological training is vital for the repeated transition between planes known as dives. After each dive, astronauts must undergo a decompression session in the cognitive recording chairs to record their experience in the plane. Uh, gathered data has conclusively proven that something something within the astral plane uh, vary wildly between astronauts. On rare occasions, these dives can result in losses, often occurring when the team encounter aggressive astral entities. Yeah, we did that one. Okay. Oh, we got more hotline crap. Yeah, it's the astro uh, astro maze. Sure. I'm averse to using objects of power. I don't want to lean on things I ultimately can't trust. But the ashtray and the cigarette, smoking there forever, have their uses. The ashtray maze they conjure is an impossibly changing labyrinth that no one but the binder and those the binder invites can ever pass through. Okay. The things we hid in dimensional research, the things Darling studies, the danger and the risk involved, 
call for every measure of security and protection I could bring to the table. The maze, hands down, is our strongest lock. Ah. I gave Darwin and his chosen crew license to pass through the maze. Lately, I've started to think I should revoke that license. Okay. Group think. This study extends the work of Irving Janus, uh, Robert Baron, and others by proposing strong casual links between groupthink and the passive or active use of telepathy. To prove these connections, the parapsychology department carried out variations of Solman's, uh, Solman Ash's uh, original conformity experiments uh, using a telepathic individual as the subject. Extensive uh, qualitative and quantitative data resulting in the, uh, from these experiments was you then used to identify telepathic interference within the, or interference, sorry. Uh, within the group. Further empirical findings suggest that measures can be taken to safeguard against telepathic influence on behaviors by engaging in something. Uh, rather boldly, this paper stands to revolutionize decades of group the theory and provide new directions for further experimentation on mind, uh, including manipulation of blank and blank. Ooh, how to get there. Perfect. Yep. Fantastic. Uh, Nadine sent this research to uh, for analysis read my precognitive powers. Urgent! Dr. Darling, last night I had a dream. In the dream, I was given the solution to the staffing problem I'd been presented with just yesterday. The problem is of a confidential nature and must therefore remain unclarified here, but I can assure you that the method through which I received this helpful information was undeniably paranatural. I can only draw the conclusion that I possess exceptional precognitive abilities and as such offer my services to the Bureau's research teams. We must utilize my powers for the greater good. Sign Francis. All right there, Francis. Why are you red? Ooh. Dang. That was a pretty powerful dash. Before the recording devices, or we're using the recording devices, please ensure the following safety measures are met. Ensure the volunteer is securely fastened in the chair. Ensure the hood is placed over the volunteer's head. This will prevent the volunteer from taking visual stimuli during the recording uh, record process, which can lower the quality of captured footage. This also prevents recording technicians from viewing the volunteer's face, which undergoes muscle spasms during the recording that some consider upsetting. Uh, check to, if the volunteer is comfortable. Activate the recording apparatus. After recording is complete, check volunteer cognitive ability using the provided questionnaire. Reminder, do not be alarmed if the length of recorded footage exceeds the volunteer's period of unconsciousness. Astral dilation is known as a known issue. If any problems arise during this process, contact your supervisor. Okay, so I came from up there. Let's pull up a map real quick. So, parapsychology. Okay, so I guess we are going through the hypnosis lab? Like, is that where I actually want to go? Kind of looks like it. Okay. So then what was back up here? Other than the mod I didn't pick up. Not that I've been looking at them all that much. There you go. So then what is over now? Marshall, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Who is this? My name is Jesse Faden. I'm coming to help. Faden? Hold on. I'm sending the elevator for you. No, no, no. You got that right. 
No, I'm not taking that yet. Ah. More of you? Ugh. Good talk. Well, now I gotta look in here. Gentlemen. How we doing? I see it. Another object of power? They're just standing there. Mesmerized by it. Huh. Okay. Oh boy. Man, you don't look so hot. You doing okay? You taking your vitamins? Oh, I didn't take my, my gummies today. Vitamin gummies. Nothing so fun. Nothing will happen when I bind to the box? Nah, I'm sure it'll be fine. Listen, if it didn't want me to bind to the box, it wouldn't give me the option, right? Oh, I see. So I need to make a picture. All right. What sort of picture do we need to make? That one. Me guys, please state your name for the record. All Warren, Astromark, first class. And you are aware that exposure to the astral plane can result in death, disability, personal injury, corporeal entangling, cognitive collapse, loss of ego, and partial to full dementia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Acknowledge that your use of the astral conduit, aka the X ray light box, is purely voluntary. Yes, I do. Perfect. Your suit is good? Yeah. Okay, you're all set. Open the door for Mr. Warren, please. All right. <gasps> Touch the box. I assume this is going to allow me hypnosis. Yeah, seize. Yeah, that's what I thought. How does one seize? I'm sure it'll tell me. Yeah, this is going to let me utilize. Okay, how does one seize? You didn't... You... Oh. 
Oh. All right. Fuck. Oh. Okay, I feel less bad about that. Oh. Can I hit him now? Ah. You're my friend now. Jesus. Terrible shot, though. Can I have more than one? How many can I have? More than one. Okay. see well i just said neat and i know exactly what i'm gonna have to do uh special does my wife like to play video games no nah. oh they're all dead are you you gonna stay dead their brains were fried when i took over the object oh well that's convenient uh, yeah, no, my, my wife does not really play, uh, any video games, which is a goddamn shame. Oh, that thing rebuilt itself. That's fun. Oh, that was the way we came in. Okay, now we can go in the elevator. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, I did get early harvest moon a long time ago. Like, I could probably get her to play cozy games. Hello. Cool. Let me go check out the washrooms real quick. Yep. See, this is what I'm talking about. Rubber duck. Discovered in the home of Agent Something after his young daughter completed being followed by her rubber duck. According to the agent, the matter was ignored, leaving to be the result of the child's imagination until he began to hear the quacking at night. After discovering the item hiding in his daughter's closet, he brought it to the Bureau for study. Update! It was discovered that Agent Blank was bringing uh, known paranatural materials into his home, illegally taking them outside of the oldest house. How this may have affected the creation of an alternate item is being investigated. The agent has been terminated. Ah. <laughs> well, that's not great. Her hobbies include complaining and being boring. No, no, no. My wife has her own hobbies, just video games ain't one of them. I'm sure I could probably convince her to play a game or two. Okay, so that's that. Oh, is this? Oh. Wait. Oh, this is a separate section. Like, Darling's office is across the way. I literally can't get... Oh, that's fun. That's an interesting building choice. Do I have anything fun? I have ability points. I want to grab grenades and explosives. <laughs> that seems like one I really do need to invest in. Uh, my wife, who normally does not play video games, really got into Elden Ring. Really? Really? <laughs> Uh, oh, I can construct Pierce. 
We shall call this one Brosnan. I should look at the mods. Stardew Valley is pretty simple and fun. Yeah. I don't know if farming, like life sims, are um, are really her vibe. I could probably find other cozy games that would work. Uh, okay, those are all assets. Loadout. This is what I wanted. So instead of spin, how about Pierce? And what can I put on Pierce? Oh my god, I have so many. Uh, damage while aiming, 21%. Okay. 28%. Well, then you're useless. Destroy you. Damage against enemy armor, pretty high. Okay. Headshots. Oh, that's just for anything, though. That's not exclusive to Pierce. Okay. What's that for? Oh, that's spin. Ooh, I should put that on spin. We're going to put that on. God, that's my best accuracy mod right now. Yikes. There we go. Yeah, and Chash got choke on it. Okay. You love the spin gun the most and then Pierce. I love the uh, mini uh, <laughs> Gatling gun vibe. Uh, yeah, no, I uh, I can totally see that. I like spin. I think spin is probably going to become one of my normal uses once I've got the choke down because I'm bad at aiming. <laughs> And so having a gun that goes, uh, is not really conducive. Uh, she really dug the aesthetic and got decent at it. She never finished. But she got love for than I did. I mean, kudos to her. Uh, launch efficiency. What am I holding right now? Health boost. Okay. Well, I have better health boosts, so... Shield, evade energy cost, recovery speed, that one might be useful. Okay, for now I'm just going to put on... Yeah, I'm going to put on... Teach that. We can get rid of these ones because we got better ones at home. Right, like we've got better throw, so why would we need two? Okay, and then extra slot. I'm gonna go with energy recovery for now. There we go. I should be slightly more lethal. Keep upgrading, it gets better. I mean, yeah, I guess I can do that, can't I? I can go here, I can go to Astral Construct, no. I think I crashed the game. Neat. I crashed the game. All right. <laughs> One moment while I relaunch it. It's uh, cloud syncing at the moment. Give me one second. Got to hit the sack. So excited you're playing this game. Enjoy. I, I am enjoying it. I shall try to do continue doing that. Uh, thank you, uh, Spazel, and, uh, you know, sweet dreams. Game crashed a little. Hopefully I didn't lose too much there. <laughs> uh, oh, that all still seems good. So. I 
Okay, so... Upgrade to enable higher tier. Oh, this is upgrading what mods I can get through this. Okay. Upgrade the grip. Okay, so I need to save up for this. I have everything else for it now, so I need to just save up bits <laughs> for it. All right. <gasps> There's a lucky kitty. Fantastic. Oh, I can't play the, the bass. What's this? Uh. What does that do for me? Other than having a four leaf clover on my person. starting to worry okay level five door to get us there hey I've got one of those elephants in my house All right, let's chatter. This might take us up to the end of the stream. Congratulations on your appointment, Director Faden. I'm Helen Marshall, head of Bureau Operations. Zachariah's dead then, and I assume you found his gun. Just call me Jesse. Trench told me to find you. He said you could help. And he told you this through the hotline. Makes sense. None of this phases her? Really? Here's the situation. Darling created the HRAs in a lab nearby. We need more if we're gonna survive this attack. My rangers can't secure the lab alone, not against those things. We need more firepower. At least she seems to know what's going on here. She could know about Dylan. I can clear out the hiss. I'll be your firepower. That's a good answer. <laughs> Is she testing me? Darling has systems in place to protect his labs. This should help you get past them. We'll talk more after you... Level 5? Rangers, let her through. No. We are level... 4, I assume? Okay, we're done talking then. Seriously. I've been in threshold safer than this. And a hit sort of turned the house into a threshold, huh? Alright. Oh boy! I'm trying to figure out how to use this thing. Okay. Kind of hard to actually look down the scope on this. I mean, it's one-shotting, dude, so I kind of appreciate that. Oh, okay. Eventually, that will go off on its own. I can't hold it forever. Oh, is he a good guy? It's really hard to tell. Yep. I guess I should get down there. But what if... I open this instead. I'm just spitballing. Oh, there wasn't even anything in here. Oh, no, never mind. Alright, it was all worth it. Rangers over there. We have to help 
of them. Not a great time for that. Thank you. Whoops. Sorry, guys. Okay. Okay, I do kind of dig this because it's just one-shotting dudes right now, and I appreciate it. Unless you miss. Did I get, he just get kicked at it? No, okay, he's all right. What the? Ah, Jesus. Oh my God. <laughs> well, yeah, I guess that worked. <laughs> just <laughs> I managed to dodge all the explosions. I don't think anybody else managed to dodge, <laughs> dodge that, though. Sorry, dude. <laughs> we may have exploded some dude. Excuse me? Okay. Ah, uh, okay. I see. Lick it. Not everything is for licking, T3. Sometimes licking things is bad. Hey, man. Okay, I see. Yeah. Come on. There we go. <laughs> yeah, okay. Ah. Ah, okay. Gotta run away. Oh, you got ads? That's cheating. Oh, I'm gonna fucking die. Good evening, T3. You have no idea what we're doing, but lick it. Not all your problems can be solved with licking. Save the game, dummy. I'm about to. I just have to do this. I got rudely interrupted. There we go. Okay, we've ungoofed this control point. Synchronicity lab. Weapon wands are full. Oh, hold on. I can fix that. Let's see. Shatter projectile boost. Projectiles fired. Okay. Uh, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that one because we have a better one right there. 
Don't need that. We literally got a better one equipped. Got a better one. Got a better one. Where are the recoils? There we go. Perfect. Now, can I look at the map? So we want to go that way. But what if not that way? First off, can I go back up here and tell them that they can, like, get in here now? steals your soul don't worry we've already sold yours but working here nope okay apparently they're fine not securing this at all okay great well why would i go where i need to go when i could go somewhere else Okay. First what, uh, quote I used in work today when I showed up on my day off, which was what? Mirror testing? Okay. Sorry, thing number one, then less than thing, and I don't, T3, I don't understand what, what that means. Uh, explanation, uh, experimentation was with, experimentation with global synchronous, uh, synchronicity. As a test, television sets were placed in a variety of locations around the world inside rooms identically decorated. The hypothesis was that by uh, identically altering the decor of every room and then changing the channel in every room but one, that the single differing television would spontaneously align in the coming frequency to match its synchronized counterparts. The experiment seemed like a failure until it was observed that the agents responsible for arranging and monitoring these rooms were all experiencing the same emotional turmoil as one clinically depressed member of the team, himself being located in the eastern part of something. Psychological examination of the agents proved the correlation. Interestingly, the phenomenon of synchronicity did occur, but not in the ways we predicted. Oh, the X-ray light box. The object is a light box used to examine X-ray images. The images cannot be removed from the light box. The information on the images belongs to a patient named something. The object allows paired utilitarians to forcefully seize an individual's, I guess, it's a free will. The seized individual becomes uh, bonded to the user or allied. The effect lasts for an amount of time. Once released, the seized die as a result of the psychic trauma. The object has no current binder. Background. A janitor named something uh, bound the object at St. Anne's Hospital in something. Soon the building's occupants were something by him. Uh, the Bureau dispatched an emergency response team to something the perpetrator and something the item. <laughs> okay. His cluster. His clusters are unique in that they are concentrated manifestations of his resonance without the need of a host. His clusters are dense spherical compressions of his resonance that ser serve to support functions in the hierarchy of his entities. The clusters are capable of replenishing his hosts with infusions of resonance. This does not heal any physical damage inflicted on the organic host, but rather seems to rejuvenate them, allowing them to endure more bodily harm than normally possible. The fact that the his make an effort to preserve its corrupted host underlines a level of awareness and discretion that was previously just speculation on my part. Can this entity be considered an individual or simply an extension of the his as a whole? Capturing one alive would be quite interesting. The warps. What is the warped? Which one was the warped that I fought? 
But they're the ones in the chairs? They have warped field, only paranatural abilities, similar to drifters. They're able to telekinetically shield themselves with the nearby material and launch objects at their target. These entities are particularly destructive and difficult to kill, possibly indicating a greater internal reinforcement of hiss resonance. Oh no, this is like what, what the dude I just fought was. Uh, why do certain hiss display paranatural abilities while others rely on Bureau of Firearms? Excuse me. Do certain corrupted entities have less potential than the hosts uh, that become hiss warped? Or is this perhaps an indication of evolution or maturation of the hiss corruption? Are there other stages of evolution yet to be found? What are the hiss inhabitants uh, or inhabits? What if the hiss inhabits a host for a month, a year? Do hosts expire after a certain amount of time? Does the corruption become too strong for an organic body to endure? Only time and well-documented observation will tell. Yeah, I, really, I listened to that. Okay. But not this book? Okay. I guess we go down to the mirror test now. No, we don't. Well, there's something in there we want, though. So I guess we'll come back to this. Oh, can't go in there yet. Okay. Where's this elevator? Where's this go? Hello? Where the fuck am I? Okay, thank you for the file. That was very helpful. I have re-archived it uh, with the BlackRock research in case you need to refer to them again. Uh, yes, the video shoots are always interesting. I expect my availability for those to decrease in the future, however, as my analysis of this newly discovered BlackRock variant is reaching a critical point. I hope you'll be able to attend them still. Uh, Darling seems to be under a lot of pressure lately, and I'm sure he would appreciate any support you can provide. Uh, regarding the analysis you provided, I do not have any questions. Thank you for the expeditious delivery. <laughs> uh, Huber got shot down. Rituals. Uh... Obsessive compulsive disorder, hoarding, anxiety disorders. While certain manifestations of these conditions are simply the result of mental illness, sometimes the individuals are simply performing something called rituals. Uh, the something of rituals can vary. Numerology, dream logic, forfeiture, uh, verbal formulae, repetitive action, and casual tethering are just some of the procedures involved. Some rituals are consistent, such as pulling the light switch cord three times to enter the motel, but some are erratic. While most people engage in minor rituals every day, the vast majority do not understand the importance behind their actions. Avoiding disaster, amassing luck, or simply locating lost keys are all the results of daily rituals. Individuals who recognize a deeper meaning behind these compulsive actions are inherently aware of the paranatural world and, when located, should be considered for employment at the Bureau. Is that it? That's all I came up here for? And they do have a lot of plants in here, huh? Why was there an elevator just to do that? It's weird. It's weirdly weird. Weird design. I don't know. Where are we going? Which way? This way. Hold on. Extra shelter. What if I could hop into one of these like mid fight and close the door and give myself a breather? Oh no, the, the proposal for the threshold kids. 
With the recent arrival of the something, there are certain glaring gaps in the Bureau's ability to educate and raise a young child. There are no other somethings, uh, children, uh, for something children to play with, and something is expected to learn about frightening new concepts. Uh, children require a slow, child-friendly introduction to paranormal topics. With this in mind, allow me to introduce the Threshold Kids, a television show in which a cast of cheerful puppets explain the dangers of living at the Bureau, but also show the fun side of the paranormal. Budget would be minimal. I took a few puppet making courses at my local community center. We can have research staff build the sets, record the footage, and even do the voices. It will be good for morale, and I guarantee children will respond positively to these videos. We can't expect a child to enjoy lectures and people in lab coats, but as television has proven for years, children love, uh, or kids love puppets. Having watched one of those videos, no, they do not. There is absolutely no way the kids were into it. Oh, look, there's the rubber duck. Altered item number 52 AE analysis, session two. I will begin by introducing various stimuli to the item. First, a low voltage electric shock. No response. Next, I will introduce heat via a standard Bunsen burner. That's not what that sounds like. That's a blowtorch. No response. Next, a series of solutions will be applied, each with a different value on the pH scale from 0 to 14. No response to any value. Next, I will attempt to communicate. Can you understand? Me? Hello. Can you understand my words? Quack, if you can understand my words. No response. This concludes session two. We'll need time to prepare further tests. Okay. Nothing in that room. I noticed that there are doors to get to the dock. Okay. Mm -hmm. This way to the lab. This looks fine. Everything looks fine here. HRAs. Sounds like Darling built them. And most of the things around here. If Marshall can't help us with Dylan, he's our next best bet. Assuming he's not dead. Or taken over by the hiss. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Okay. Oh. Okay. Nope. Hmm. Oh. Huh. Interesting. This feels like something I do later.
Oh. There we go. Max, you've played the game. Is that mirror thing for later? It feels like I need to be able to fly so I can go into it or something. Any idea how to make it work? Or am I literally about to find out? <laughs> It's later? Yeah, all right. Like I said, this game is a Metroidvania dressed up. <laughs> I've, I've tricked myself into playing a Metroidvania. Okay. Blackrock prisms are unique formations of Blackrock distinct in both their shape and potency. While the density of black rock dampens the paranatural forces, the unique something structure of prisms retain frequencies in the range of something to something else, with perfect something harmonization. Uh, this report analyzes the results of focusing a something through a harmonized prism to a something else. Uh, methods for the imprinting of non-physical fields onto something, imbuing them with the properties of the harmonized resonance, something else, in the prism will be explored and explained. Okay. Mrs. Seems important. Alright, throw the lever, Kronk. Hello again, Director. It appears we have a new problem. We need to get the HRA machine working. I've replaced a couple of spark plugs, but this looks a bit more complicated. Darling must have had a system. Randomness isn't in his nature. The punch cards, the symbols, the terminals. How do they connect? I'll see what I can do. Okay. All right, so one. Two. Three. Gonna lead me up there, yeah. Got an E on it, or three. That's a three, not an E. Fuck. <sighs> Two, one. And then where's four? So, we need to find all the punch cards. Yeah, I'm working on it. So, one, two, three. Oh, there's four. Okay, so. First one is Umbrella Corp. Then each punch card should correspond. So two is cube. Two is cube and three is that one little panel. This one. Fucking crushed it. Trying to throw puzzles at me. Don't even know who I am. Huh. 
I'm sorry. Is she using like a modified Tommy gun? Darling's prototypes have a lot of issues. We need a new plan. What? What the hell gun are you using, lady? It's like a military Tommy gun, but with a barrel that doesn't make any sense. Okay, let's talk to you. We need more Black Rock prisms to make this machine work. Darling has another lab down in the Black Rock ah. processing site and maintenance. That must be where he keeps the prisms. I've been to maintenance already. I can find my way. But how long will that take? Nothing here is simple. I need to ask her now, before I go. I need something from you first. What do you know about Dylan Faden? I knew this was coming. Lives are at stake here, and we need this machine working to save those lives. Once that is done, Director Faden, then we can talk. She's right. As hmm. much as I don't want to admit it, I'm the only one who can help. Fine. I'll get the prisms first. Dylan will have to wait just a little longer. Yeah, just a little. But don't call me Director. Jesse is fine. I'll call you Faden. Here, you'll need this key card. All right. Thanks. Emily Pope has set up a base in Executive. Once I have the prism, I'll meet you there. Right. I'll move out immediately. And keep an eye out for Darling. Finding him might be the key to stopping the hiss. Well, it's just one large scale HRA. It's there now. We are about to be exposed to a different kind of resonance. Hostile, viral, invasive resonance. Okay. That's, that's what the Hedron resonance amplifiers are for. Taking the protection Hedron can provide us. What's Hedron? And keeping us from being wiped out. I assume this is the Black Rock Quarry. Here, this will lead back to Central Research. Okay. Would have been pretty convenient to have that at the start, but all right. Hi, right, Chucky. Oh, wow, that just sends us right around, huh? Okay, but I don't want to do that yet. Because there was a f level 4 door to unlock. Why they study the large Hadron Collider? Oh. Are there any other level four? Fuck this noise. I'm out. Nope. I'm running. I'm not doing it. Oh, that's level five. Shit. Uh. You know what? Fuck it. Oh, there's dudes up there. Fuck this. Gentlemen. Okay. Uh, so we want to go back to where? Maintenance. Where are we going again? 
Hold on. How did I already forget this? Blackrock Quarry. Right. Uh, in the Blackrock Quarry was in central maintenance. Okay. So yeah, I'm going to go to the NCS power plant. And that's where we will leave things off for the for the evening. God, my jaw's all tense. Uh, but I have abilities, and I should do that. What's this? Seize duration. Okay. I don't know how much I'm going to use seize. It's probably worth investing eventually. Launch enemies? Well... Being able to grab and yeet enemies sounds great. Okay. I now have 29 spect or, uh, spectral dollars. Right. I don't know what you want to call them. HRAs first. They'll help save everyone, including Dylan. Once I find him. God, you're making a bunch of assumptions. So now just grip gets the second thing. Okay. You keep him safe. Like you do with me. Okay, we're doing this. What do the countermeasures do? Oh, right. That's this, this bonus crap. No, 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 no. All right. That's what we're going to call for for today. We have saved. We've upgraded. We've moved the story forward. We only died a couple times. I'd say that's pretty good. Right? Is the music going to play? There we go. I forgot we're undoing some swing. All right. But, uh, yeah, that is gonna do it for me tonight. Ugh. Whew. Uh, I'm gonna be back tomorrow, uh, with more control. Um, yeah. 9.30 p.m. Eastern. Uh, I'll be back, and I guess we will go find more Black Rock stuff, I guess. Um... But yeah, that is going to do it for me tonight. So, uh, first, I shall say goodbye to you, TikTok. So, bye, TikTok. Like I said, be back tomorrow, uh, 9.30 p.m. Eastern. I'll be doing more control. So, stop on by. Okay, kill that. Camera was chill all night. It was. It's not even that warm, so I don't know. Camera just, camera just didn't want to yesterday, I guess. Um... But yeah, that's it. That I'm 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 done uh, for tonight. So uh, yeah, yeah. Only oh, got a couple streams. I'm not I'm not gonna read, but uh, it's because I was here. I made it. Uh, you made it hot. Fair enough. Um, yeah, that's gonna do it for me tonight. Like I said, tomorrow 9:30 p.m. Eastern, I will be back playing more Control. Uh, but that's gonna do it for me tonight. So as always, thank you of course for watching. Until next time, stay safe, have fun, be kind, and try your best out there. Bye-bye.